Today on Horseland. Over there, Chili. We've got to go back. Separated and lost on the trail, <laughs> Molly and Chili must learn to get along in order to survive. Bear! Chili! are incredibly strange. What do you be there, Gora? Humans are strange. They have cozy rooms and nice warm beds and roofs that keep the rain out. Let's not forget extra layers. It's gonna be cold. And they choose to go sleep on rocky dirt in the cold night air. It's the twilight trek. It's part of their classes here at Horseland. They're learning to take care of themselves, to trust each other, and their horses, too. You mean like us pigs and dogs and cats trust each other? That's right, Tinny. You trust me, and I trust you. But those human folk don't always give trust the chance to grow. They are so going to love the Twilight Track. Hey, if I didn't have tickets to the terribly exclusive, Achoo! the terribly exclusive Wellington Downs horse show, I'd go again. Yeah, it was great being out there on our own, but I think I'm gonna spend the next few days resting. Achoo! <laughs> I wish we could do a real solo trek. Yeah, why does Will have to watch over us? Doesn't he trust us? Yeah, who says we're not old enough to go alone, huh? Um, the Horseland rules, our parents, common sense. Well, besides that, we'll still be on our own. We each have our own campsite. We'll have to depend on our horses, and they'll have to depend on us. Achoo! You really learn how to trust your horse when you're alone with him. When I gave Chili his lead on the way back, he took me through an old apple orchard <laughs> that even Bailey didn't know about. Man, I can hardly wait. What's it like setting up camp so late in the day? It's a good way to learn how to work fast, because it's getting dark. And it's a great way to catch a cold, so dress warm. Let's see now. Saddlebag, check. Sleeping bag, check. You're ready, Molly. Trust me. You think so? I know so. Now let's get Bailey and get started. Of course, it all depends on the rider you're dealing with. We horses know what we're doing. It was great with Chloe, but I can't imagine a twilight trek with one of the other riders. I can't wait to get out there with Molly. The forest at night, under the stars, it's gonna be great. Ow! What's the matter, Calypso? I ah, don't know. My back, it hurts. Oh, no! It's a hot spot! It's a bad one, Calypso. Right in the middle of your back. I can't let Molly see. I have to go on the track. Won't she see it when she puts on your saddle? It's high up. Maybe she won't see. Ooh, but it hurts. Hot spots can get infected, Calypso. You have to let them treat it. And that means no saddle. Oh, 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 a hot spot. Calypso has a hot spot. That sounds bad. Poor Calypso, poor Molly. You mean lucky Calypso and lucky Molly. This means nice warm beds for them tonight. Poor Chloe didn't sound too good. Sure glad I didn't catch that cold. I wouldn't miss tonight for anything. Who's looking after Chili while Chloe takes a few days off to feel better? Uncle John will, while we're on the trek. There's no day off when you're caring for a horse. It's time, girl. <laughs> what happened to your blanket?
blanket. Calypso? Ooh, it's a hot spot, Molly. Oh, no! Poor Calypso! How could I have missed it? Don't worry, Molly. I'll call the vet and have him come by in the morning. He can check on her. Oh, but what about the trek? We could wait a day or two. I don't think anybody would mind. Weather's gonna be turning. We go tonight or wait till next month? Next month? Let me check with Bailey's folks. Don't worry, girl. We'll get you better. Okay, thanks. I'll tell her. They say you can go tonight. Yes! But you'll have to ride Chili. Chili? Think about it. Chloe won't be able to ride him for a few days. This will be a good chance for Chili to get some exercise. Come on! We don't want to do this without you. But I can't ride Chili. He's Chloe's horse and... Well, there's something about that horse. I just don't trust him. And does anyone ask me if I want her as a writer? No! It's just not right. So what's it gonna be? Come on, Mal. Just one night. Okay. <sighs> I guess so. Good deal. Great. We get a twilight trick and Chili gets a workout. Everybody wins. Everybody, Everybody except, except me. me. Sorry, girl. It's you and me next time. Molly, we're ready. Coming. Get well, sweetheart. See you tomorrow. Can't believe I'm riding Chloe's horse. I like my feet lower than Chloe. Or maybe my legs are longer. Everything okay? Just getting the stirrups right. Molly really doesn't want to ride Chili, does she? Would you? I mean, going out at night on an unfamiliar horse? She could at least give him a chance. Chili's a good horse. Okay, I think I'm ready. All right then, let's get a move on. Bye, Calypso. <sighs> let's move it, Chili. I'm kind of worried about Molly. Never seen her this way. Maybe I should follow him in case there's a problem. Good idea, Shep. Look, the Twilight Trek is when humans learn to trust their horses and themselves. So let them learn. You two worry too much. <sighs> Maybe you're right. How are they doing back there? Hard to tell. You know, Calypso likes bringing up the rear, so she can keep an eye on the others. No, it's because she's slow. What do you say? Race? Okay, Will? Okay. Let's go! You're on! Yeah! Come on, Aztec. We're not gonna let them win, are we? Yeah! Hey, not without us either. Come on, Calypso! Whoa! I mean, Chili. Man, I am not used to this saddle or this horse. What's taking Molly so long? Can't you go any faster, Chili? I'd go faster if I thought I could trust her to stay in the saddle. Molly doesn't look too happy. Neither does Chili. She can see us now. Come on. Over there, Chili. They crossed the creek there. Chili! Oh, this is better. Not as deep here. You know this creek, huh, Chili? <laughs> Looks like Chili won that round. Hello? Hey, you were right. Just this once. That doesn't mean you're running things. Got it. Molly, do you have your sleeping bag? Yeah, sure, it's right. No way! It's not there! Eva Marie found it, back in the stable. Poor Molly. When she switched horses, she forgot it. And it's gonna be cold tonight. 
plenty of daylight left. Follow the trail back and get your gear. I have to go back? Zoe's gonna meet you halfway with it. We'll be right here. Oh! Hey, think of it as a survival lesson. You'll never forget your sleeping bag again. Wouldn't have forgotten if I had my own horse. Plenty of daylight, he said. With my luck, it'll be pitch black by the time we get back. Molly! Zoe! Got your sleeping bag. Okay. At least Molly has all of her gear now. Thanks, Zoe. This whole thing has turned into a real challenge. How's Chili doing? Okay, I guess. Well, I'd better get back. Getting dark. Have fun. Yeah, right. Let's go, Pepper. Zoe's going back to Horseland, so I'm gonna keep an eye on Molly. <sighs> the work of man's best friend is never done. Must be their campsites. Let's give them a call and tell them we found a place to set up our camp. Frontier girl with a cell phone. Hey, Will, we're back. I see your fire. I'm setting up camp just down the hill from you. See my flashlight? I see you, Molly. Great. Well, good night. See you in the morning. Let's go, Chili. Time for bed. Hey, where'd they go now? <gasps> Did you hear something, Chili? Just the night animals, huh? Man, I am really ready for bed. Oh. You hear the that? Wh what kind of animal makes that sound? Oh. <laughs> Chili! No! I gotta go find Chili! About time to turn in, Jimber. Wake me up if any of the trekkers need anything, huh? Tangled up in these briars, Shep. Ow! Gonna need my gloves for this. Chili, look after Shep, huh? I'll be back in a sec. Well, how are you doing, Shep, old boy? Oh, I've had better days. What are you doing here anyway? First, I was concerned about Zoe going off by herself. But then I saw you and Molly without the others and got even more worried. All she talks about is how she wishes Calypso was here instead of me. She did come looking when you got spooked. Yeah, I guess. Now let's get you out of there, boy. Hope everything's okay back at Horseland. I wonder how Calypso is doing. Chili hasn't been as bad as I thought he'd be. Still, he's not Calypso. Mom. You okay? Come back to our camp. <sighs> and get some sleep. Sorry we lost your feed bag when you were spooked, Chili. I bet you're hungry. All I have is peanut butter and jelly. <laughs> you don't like PBJs? 
Well, at least try the crust. Looks like somebody else missed dinner. Here you go, boy. So what do you think of Molly now? She fed us both dinner before she fed herself. She's not so bad, I guess. But that doesn't mean I like her. What's she got to do to earn your trust? I don't know if she can. There we go. Look at those stars. Incredible. Man, I wish Calypso was here to see him. It's always Calypso this, Calypso that. Chile, she didn't mean anything against you. She misses Calypso, that's all. I'm going back to Horseland. She can double up with one of the others. Oh, don't be ridiculous, Chile. Give the kid a chance. <sighs> Give the kid a chance. She had her chance. <laughs> Calypso wouldn't have crossed the stream there. Why can't you be more like Calypso? Molly and I just weren't meant to get along. Hold on. What was that? All right. Is that you, Shep? This is not funny. That's not dog. That smells like... Shep! Shep! Come on, we gotta get out of here! Where's the fire? No fire! Bear! Move it! <laughs> Wait! We've got to get Molly! I nearly forgot! She wouldn't forget about us! We've got to go back! Bearproof container. Hope he likes PB and J's and stays there for a while. What's the problem, boy? Ship! <laughs> Will, Bailey, Sarah, Alma! There's a bear tearing up my campsite! I left my saddlebag out! We'll be okay. All our food's in the bear bin. Lucky you're a light sleeper, Molly. I'm not. Chili woke me up. Good job, Chili. He was loose and could have run, but he risked his own safety for mine. <laughs> I know we're safe, but I wish that bear hadn't gotten my breakfast. You can have some of what we have left if you... Hey, what's going on? Chili, that's not the way back. What now? Molly, where are you going? I don't know, 
But let's see what he wants to do. He earned my trust last night. Why not? The old orchard! Must be the one Chloe found. Chili remembered the way. Molly, looks like you get an apple for breakfast. Chili, too. Apples, cool! Perfect breakfast! I'm hungry as a bear! Nice move, Chili. If I didn't know better, I might think Molly's grown on ya. But you know better. the bramble and oh and there was a bear and you scared chap were you not too scared tina i knew molly and chili were right there to help i trusted them well hold on a second what's up molly there's something i didn't have a chance to do what's that to say thank you chili <laughs> <laughs> 